My name is Anissa and welcome to my channel. Today we'll be tackling an eyeshadow color that most people tend to stay away from just because maybe it's difficult to work with or they are afraid of how it might look. But I'm here to show you how easy it is and how simple it can be to create a red eyeshadow makeup look. Before we get started, I'm just going to zoom you guys in a little bit closer so you can see what's happening to my face. I feel like that is a good spot even though you can see the unglamness down here. But it's okay. So to start off, I like using um, Wilshire from Colourpop. This is from the K-pop collection. I'm not very sure if they sell it as a single eyeshadow. But if they do, you should definitely get this. It is a very good eyeshadow base. I'm just going to pop that all over my lids. the AC Tour palette from Australis. Uh, I'm using the medium complexion. This is perfect for crease color. I like using this palette. So I'm just going to start off from maybe this one on a fluffy blending brush and I'm going to put it all over my crease. I'm going to bring it slightly higher as well so that it kind of peeks through from my crease. be using another Colourpop eyeshadow. Um, this is in the shade Elixir. It's a nice warm reddish brown. So I'm gonna take this and I'm gonna focus it out in the outer V using a slightly smaller defining eye brush. Actually I changed my mind. I think I'm gonna put this all over my eyelids instead. line as well. This is my Freedom palette in, uh, this is called Magic. It's pretty much the red and rosy tones of it. I'm gonna use this one right here. I'm gonna focus this in my outer crease. This eye look is actually this shade. This is from the Chan Yu palette. I got this palette in Malaysia. It was cheap, 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 cheap. This is very pigmented, but it does have a little bit of fallout, so just be careful. I'm done with my eyes. Uh, but I want to put something in my inner corners just to brighten it up. I'm going to use my Colourpop um, highlighter. This is the shade Wisp and it is a pretty golden highlighter. So I'm just going to use my fingers and pop it in my inner corner. I'm going to finish off my face and I'll be right back. Okay, I'm done with my face. I finished off with a little bit of eyeliner, put a little bit of black in my tight line, like half of it, and then kind of just smudged it out a little bit. So for my lips, I think I'm gonna go nude. I will be using the Colourpop Ultra Satin in the shade Echo Pop. It's this pinky nude. <laughs> Don't really like it. I'm gonna try and top it off with this Colourpop Ultra Metallic in the shade Zebra. Um, hopefully it goes well. <laughs> yep, okay, I think I like this look better. I'm gonna zoom you guys out. This is the makeup look that I have for you guys. It is definitely not very dramatic, so definitely suitable for daytime. Um, if you guys do try it out, do let me know down in the description below 
if you have any suggestions or any eyeshadow color that you guys are afraid to try let me know down below and I'll come up with some looks for you if you guys want to see a red really dramatic eye look using black let me know down in the description as well and I will make one for you so yep this is what I have for you I hope you guys enjoy it don't forget to subscribe to my channel as well as follow me on all my social media links I have Instagram and Snapchat my Social media will be down in the description below. Um, yeah, don't forget to like the video as well. And I hope to see you guys in my next one. Bye guys, thanks for watching.